What's up everybody, it's Sailor Gren, and I'm back with you guys today for another episode of Pokemon Ruby with Sailor Gren. Um, this is episode uh, 8, I believe. Pretty sure it's number 8. Could be 9, could be 7. I have no idea. I've already lost count. So, anyway, it's whatever episode this is, so. In any case, um, we are gonna go do some training, and, um, then we'll take on the gym leader, and then we'll go from there. So, that's kind of the spiel right now. Where are we at? Pokemon. Iron workers, seen better days. Level 11, defaulter. You know, I don't think we're gonna go with iron worker. I think we're just gonna work on three heavy hitters. Marsh Tomp, Green Bag, and Defalo are gonna be in my headquarters. I believe. What you got for me, Flea Market? Super Potion. Well, thank you. Alright. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Okay, um, so before we go too far, let me just head to the Pokemon Center real quick. Heal up that one guy, whatever his name is, Iron Worker. And, um, yeah, we will go from there. Okay, so, let's roll on back to that cave where we're gonna do some battling. Alright, Defalope, let's do this thing. Go, Defalope! Boom. Super effective. Okay, we are definitely training you. It was last time, and you guys didn't see this, but last time I got killed by one of these freaking Makarita things. Oh yeah. Knocking them loose. Knock them teeth loose. Oh no, a level six. Oh, I'm so scared. What? So I could one shot the other one, but I can't one shot this one? I'm confused. Confused. Better punch myself in the face. <laughs> yep, I don't know. <laughs> it hurt itself in its confusion. I have yet to understand why that happens. How that happens. How do you hurt yourself in confusion? It's... I don't know. It's bizarre. Heck. Ouch, ouch, pain, agony, ow. Something is pinching on my arm and it's not cool.
Yay, Defalope. Yay. Oh my god. There's no way in hell I can catch that, though, as much as I want it. Yep, see you later. At least I can't catch one right now. Dun dun dun! That's right, get screwed. That was a critical hit. I feel sorry for you. I feel sorry for you. Ding. Yay, Defilope. One second, guys. Let me just button this up. Random question for you guys. Has anyone watching this Ever had the um, Lay's potato chip flavor chicken and waffles? I have, and it's absolutely disgusting. I, oh god. I wanted to vomit after I ate it. Chicken and waffles. Who the hell in their right mind came up with that flavor? What were they smoking? This is what I want to know. I don't know about you guys, but that shit's disgusting. Um, oh yeah, and then, random side note, um, this, this cream soda stuff is okay when it's fresh, but when it sits for a while and the fizz goes away, it's like drinking s syrup. Cold syrup is what it's like now. There's no fizz to it. Yep, it's nasty. Ugh. It's like... I mean, it, it kind of tastes flat already anyway, just because, it's, you know, it's cream soda. It kind of has a flat kind of a taste. But, um, now it's really flat. But I suppose I shouldn't complain. It was on the uh, Honda all day when I was out cruising around. So... Go, Defalope! What should Defalope do? Heck! Oh yeah, that's right. Oh no, leech life! Ah. Yeah, right. Oh, aren't you special? You changed, you changed your color. <laughs> ah. Sorry about that. Sorry, MacBook. This poor MacBook. I always do all of my bodily functions in its general direction. Poor little thing. I'm sorry! Oh my god. Now, um... Those of you watching this... Um... I'm sure you can see the screen of my MacBook over here. So... But you can't see what's in front of me. So you... New viewers might be like, How the hell can he play when he's not even looking at it? Well... I have a TV right here, which is hooked up to my MacBook via HDMI to Thunderbolt, so 
That's how I'm seeing this. I'm not using the force. But, you know. Uh, that was pathetic. Honest to God, patheticness. I... I am ashamed. I am known for my earth-shaking, window-shattering burps. If you've ever seen me drink Bark's Root Beer, you know what I'm talking about. Or Diet 7-Up. That's... That stuff's really good for burps. <laughs> I mean, uh, I'm not trying to gross out my female viewers, but just the same. I'm my guy, come on. You know I have to do that. It's a bodily function. I mean, seriously. Get over it. Better up than down. Anyway. anyway. Um, okay, where is Defalope at now? I have not been keeping track. Okay, so I need to get Defalope up to pretty much level 20. That's the highest Pokemon I have. At least level 18. And if I'm going that far, I might as well go to 20. Because the uh, gym leader's Pokemon are, is like, one of them is like level 16 and then another one it's a uh, Makuita thing, and it's l level 18, which is vicious. That thing's just vicious as hell, so. I need at least two big heavy hitters. I need Defalope and Marshtomp. I almost won with Marshtomp, but I ran out of healing items. Had I been able to use, like, a potion or something, I would have won the match, no problem. On video, nonetheless. Unfortunately. That didn't happen. And I don't remember what the problem was with the video, but... Anyway, it didn't air. So, I don't think. But, I don't know. Anyway. Oops. Oh, another Agra. I wish I could capture one of you. I would need a Master Ball, though. <laughs> See ya. Yep, so, um... Today, I went cruising on the, uh... Honda PCX for a good solid three hours or so. Probably more than that, actually. Probably more like five hours today. Oh my god, I'm so sore. But, um, yeah. I had a blast, though. I always do. <coughs> but, um, yeah, so. Yay, Defalope! Oh, hell yeah. Learn that shit. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, yeah. That's gonna help tremendously. Um, also, while I was out cruising today, uh, my earbuds were dead, so I couldn't have any tunage going today. Because I've got these, um. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, I have two pairs of wireless earbuds. They're from the same brand and company, but one pair is better than the other one. But. One pair I use for motorcycling, and another one I use at the YMCA. Um, but anyway, so... 
both of my pairs of earbuds were dead today. Um, I had my Moto pair on the charger today. Um, but anyway, so the point of all of this madness is that I had no music. I just had me and the roar of the engine and the ground beneath my tires. So. One shot! So, um, yeah. So, as you can imagine, me being me, I lost my mind about a quarter from the end of it. I just lost my mind. It went so far that I was actually singing the ABCs in opera style. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yep. But it's it's what you do to keep yourself occupied, you know. Um no, you guys can't hear a sample. Maybe at the end of the video, but... I don't know. Next time I'm on the bike with the camera, I might reenact that for you. Which reminds me... Oh, I need to drill that stupid hole in the case so I can actually plug in my microphone. That way I can actually make videos on the thing. Keep forgetting to do that. I'll do it one day. I'll either do that or I'll get the right case that I need. Um, for my old GoPro, the, um, Hero 2 that I have, which is now in possession of the Borkus, which, um, Borkus, if you're watching this, you need to start making videos with that. Anyway, um, so, yeah. That's about all I know. Um, I kind of lost my train of thought right now, so... yeah... So yeah. ABCs in opera. I also tried to rap the AC. The... <laughs> oh, dyslexia strikes again! I was going to say ACBs. Yep. <laughs> it's not just for eyes, folks. It's for the whole damn system. The whole damn thing. Oh my god. I'm telling you, I'm just a little bit dyslexic. Anyway, so. Anywho. Let's, um, destroy this Zubat, shall we? Oh, so close. Oh, shit. Oh. Uh-oh, Defalope's confused. Better punch himself in the face. Right? Usually my guys are pretty good about that sort of thing. So what else happened today? Um, at around lunchtime, I went to meet the Borkis at Old Chicago, and um, that went well. Um, the Borkis had a meeting to go to um, for the house that he's buying, and. Um, Yeah, so we had to leave about an hour or so after we got there. But that's okay, that's plenty of time. Um, what did I get today at Old Chicago? I got the, um... Peppered Bacon Smothered Cheese Fries. 
Normally it comes with um, sour cream on it, um, diced tomatoes, and green onions. All three of those things I get taken off it. And um, I, I make sure and have it come with a side of ranch because I'm a ranch fiend when it comes to french fries of any kind. So, that's that. Cheese fries and ranch. Don't knock it till you try it. It's 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 freaking good. I'm telling you, it, it tastes great. Um, I mean, anything with ranch tastes pretty much amazing. But that's just me. But then again, ranch is the ul the uh, ultimate flavor killer. If there's a raunchy ass flavor in your mouth, just go eat something with ranch dressing and um, it'll kill it usually it'll kill it anyway if it's cold and not like thick but not like ultra runny either like you know good ranch then it'll kill it no problem by far though the best ranch ever that I have ever tasted has been at Outback Steakhouse. They have the absolute best cheese fries in history. Outback Steakhouse. Go there, order yourself a um, nice full plate of the Aussie cheese fries. Um, I don't remember if it comes with anything on it or not, but just get the straight cheese fries with bacon on it. And, um, anyway, and, uh, and, um, make sure and get a big cup of ranch with that. It comes with ranch, which usually it comes in a big cup like that, but one time I was there, and they gave us a really small cup of it, and that's not cool, so. You need lots of ranch. Eat as much as you can at Outback. It's worth the price, honest to god. Um, and then, what I get there is, I get the, um, the fish and chips. It's some kind of fish, I don't remember what. But, um, and then chips, obviously, or french fries. So, um, you do have an option to turn the side of fries that come with it into the Aussie cheese fries that they have, which I think is awesome because those are so sweet. But the one thing that I get differently with it is, um, come on, Deepalope, you can do this. That's right. Kill that thing. That's right. Way to go, Deepalope. Woo woo! Anyway, um, now training starts to get really slow. But anyway, so, the one thing I changed with my order at Outback with the fish and chips is I have them replace the tartar sauce with a big cup of ranch. Fish in that ranch sauce that they have? Yeah. Oh my god, it's absolutely amazing. If I could, I would buy an entire tanker truck full of that ranch. That's how good it is. It's the best on the planet. And if you argue with me about it, you're crazy. I mean, I'm crazy, but... You're crazier than I am if you argue with me about that. You're just weird. But anyway, so. That's about all I know there. I don't know how the hell we got on to that topic, but apparently we did. I don't know how long this video has been going for. Hopefully not too long. But, um... I'll probably call it quits here soon, because food just showed up. Um, I don't want it to get cold. But, 
but anyway, so. In fact, I think this is gonna be my last battle for right now. And, oh, fucking one shot, all right. Bim bam kablam. Okay. Oh, one more battle. Then we'll call it quits. Akuta. Akura. I don't know. Wing attack. Hiya. Hiya. Dang. Yay, Defalope. That's doable. So, uh, we raised six levels since we started this video. Gotta love that. I'll take it. I will take that in a heartbeat. So, we are gonna go like this and save right now. Six hours? Doesn't feel like I've been playing this thing for six hours. Crazy. Anyway. So that's that. So, um... I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um... If you did, leave a like, comment, subscribe, all of the above. Uh, what time is it? 7 o'clock, no wonder I'm tired. Okay. <coughs> so, uh, anyway, as always, thanks for watching. Be sure to follow me on Twitter and on Instagram for all of your latest Salo Grand news. And um, I'll catch you all later. Until then, I'm Salo Grin. Gotta catch them all.